Hey guys, welcome back to another video on the Savion the Bravion channel. And as you can see, we're back playing Five Nights at Freddy Security Breach Ruin. So, theoretically speaking, this should be my last video on this game as a whole. Um, I'm not sure if any more DLC is going to be released about this game. I don't know. I have... Only time will tell. But, as far as I'm aware, this is it. So, we've gotten all three of the endings. Last video, we did the Bonnie Easter Egg. And now this video, if we go to Ruin... If we go to Profile 1 Chapter Select, as you can see, we have this little symbol down here, All Collectibles Found. And I actually only have it for Chapter 9, which means I don't have the collectibles in 1 through 8. So, I figured this video going to be kind of a wrap-up video to conclude this game and uh, get the rest of the presents so we can get that 100%. And uh, yeah, so let's just get right into it. Um, going right back in from chapter one. And there you go. We're going to talk about the game. Um, so, oh man, I don't even know where to start. Um... Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Ruin. I guess I'll start by saying that this DLC completely subverted my expectations. It was Gregory? so, Gregory? so, so much better than I thought I it was going message. to be. And I didn't think it was going to be bad by any means. It's just better than I thought it would be. Gregory, um, are you there? Like, genuinely, my main, like, me playing through the, the base game, I had a blast. It was a lot of fun for me. Okay, just that alone. I don't get it. Why would Gregory tell me to come to this old place and then not be here? What is that? Maybe if I get up there, I can see better. So, like, just that alone. Um was a fun experience in of itself, okay? So, like, going into Ruin, though, seeing that the mall was going to be abandoned and crumbled down and things were going to be different, the animatronics were going to be scarier, all that stuff, I was really excited. But I was thinking that... I don't know. I was thinking maybe it was going to follow more of what the base game had in store. But the changes they made to Ruin, I feel like were all pretty much for the better like there are some very significant differences um the fact that there's no faz watch the fact that there's no recharging your flashlight there's no camera there's no phaser blast there's none of that stuff is in this game but that's not necessarily a bad thing by any means it's because the, the game never puts you in a position where you can't beat it Unless you have one of those items. And I feel like the fact that the flashlight doesn't just die on you out of nowhere is honestly a plus. Are you there? Are you there? I'm trapped. Gregory? Uh, I got your message. Where are you? Help! Something grabbed me. It won't let me go. You have to find me. I'm trapped in the sinkhole under the raceway. Under Roxy Racers? That's all the way on the other side. I'm not even close. So, yeah, as I was saying, um, I feel like everything they changed, even the fact that there's no Freddy, right? You can't just climb into Freddy's stomach and make your way through. But it's because the mall isn't like, it's not open... The game is an open world to begin with, but it's not like open, go wherever you want anymore. 
It's very like, do this, go do this, now, do this, right? Um, and it makes it so that you don't need those items. It, it gives you what you need. Um, and the main mechanic it gives you this time around is the AR mask, which is basically, in my opinion, cooler than, than just a camera or a phaser blaster. Because okay. they basically okay. redesigned each location once you get the mask to be with, like, it has what it looks like in real life. You put on the mask, there's like completely different things everywhere. Like, all over the place, there's just completely different... Chica? Like, there's bowling pins floating you? in the air, and like... You look awful. The entirety of the, like, map, like, redesigns are super cool. Even just the base locations, right? They look super awesome now that they're all tattered and broken down. And this is, like, what a lot of people were hoping the original, or like, the base game would be like with this more dark, like, scary atmosphere. Fast, it's just like my dad's. And in Security Breach, you really only get a few places like that in the entire game where it's like that dark atmosphere. Um, and, you know, most of them are in the basement. <laughs> so, you know, it, it's it's cool that we, we get, like, these new mechanics. This! This right here! This isn't in the base game. And, you know, I'm sure people hate these conduits. Me personally, I love the conduits. I, they're they're really fun for me. I don't know why. I just think they're cool. The camera stations, right? Like, sure, it would be convenient to be able to go on your Faz watch and look at the cameras, but the camera stations get the job done. You know, it does what it's supposed to, and really leaves it at that. Um. Because there's only a few times where you really even need to look at the cameras to get anything done. So, again, I think that all the changes they made mechanics-wise, I think that they hit it out of the park. Monty jump scare coming up. See, like, just the character designs that they made for, like, because, like, every... It seems like every game they try to hit us with a new aesthetic of animatronic, right? So you got your fun times in Sister Location, you got your your nightmares in 4, your phantoms in 3, your toys in 2, right? And now we have Glamrock, okay? But past Glamrock, we have Broken. Past Broken, we have Ruined, right? Where freaking Monty thing go? I better find a way out before it comes back. So, like, with ruined animatronics, now we have just this, like, horrifying atmosphere, basically. And, um, like, they, it makes it even more scary because of, like, the way they look. Going back to mechanics, I, I don't want to get too, like, Free mask. scatterbrained Please here. Take a mask. But, like, going take back to mask. mechanics, okay? Take a mask. Thank Help you. me, Please right? Enjoy. Who we're about Weird. to see in a second. It's not a Bonnie mask. Look at all the wires and stuff. Bye, mask bot. So, like, help me, right? Our good friend. Cool. Pretty useless in terms of like gameplay. He gives you, he's mainly here for lore, right? He's mainly here to like talk to you about like what's happening around you. But there's never a point where. Now, okay, the one time you can maybe say help is useful is when he gets rid of um, mixes for you, right? Like, okay, but then also that was mostly because of what we did, you know, kind of destroying the security. And also, it seems like, um, the Mimic had a part in getting rid of him there. So, you know, really not all that. Um, okay, now that I have the mask, I think I already... Let me go in my inventory, because I need to, like, 
take a look and see what I'm missing. So I already need to go back, actually, because I think there's a present over here that I missed. Yep. So there's an AR collectible back here. AR Glam Monty Plush. So if I go, let's take a look at that. I like reading the descriptions. AR Glam Monty Plush. It's hard to look at. <laughs> I bet it is. So let's see where I'm watching another video here. So let's see where this next one is. Okay, AR Bonnie Pinata. I have this. Okay, what's next? AR Nightmare Plush. I have that. Okay, and then there's a real collectible, which is comic page five. Now, I only have one, two, and eight. So comic page five is actually in the real world, of course. So then when you take off the mask, it's the same place where you would find the plush, but it's up in this. Okay, so we actually have to get down over there to we have to get to the point where we can, like, go into there. Okay. I see where I need to go. Um. So let's keep moving along. Um. Yeah, so, like, Helpy. I swear that Dory was blocked. Helpy is super hit or miss. For me. Um, I think it's cool. He's a very cool addition to see. In the game. But in terms of, like, realistically being beneficial... He's not really that. What's that supposed great. to be? <laughs> See, like here. Okay, this was cool, right? Like, okay, so let, let me take it back already. There are points where he's useful, right? Like he explains, like, why is it my voice? Like, oh, that's why it's your voice. It's like, wait, what am I supposed to do here? Here's what you're supposed to do here. But, like, past the first couple chapters, it's like, okay, I know what I'm supposed to do here. This doesn't count. Him him telling me to go this way, that doesn't count. That's not... That, that doesn't count. Yeah, he's doing way too much right now. Alright, so let's just go over here. Um, I should be seeing him in a minute. He's gonna come out of there. What are you doing, man? Um. Right. Don't stop looking for me. Mm -hmm. I need your help. Gregory. Gregory. I, I can hear you. If you can hear me, turn off all security. Turn it all off! Security? What are you talking about? None of this makes sense. Security knows. Find them and turn them all off. I can't get out until that happens. Gregory? Security knows? Yeah, we're gonna have our first little run in with notes here. Okay, so... Um, yeah, while we're on the topic of mechanics, that's a pretty key mechanic right there. Security notes, right? That's like pretty vital thing that they added to this game. So you got your parent node and your um, child nodes, right? So um, pretty interesting mechanic that they have here. Um, I, it, it basically is their way of showcasing how because this is all for the security system, so it's basically their way of, like, showing you how to quite literally breach their security, like, literally committing security breaches <laughs> right here. Um, so, personally, they're alright. I don't really feel any particular way about the security nodes. Um, I think that they are interesting and they they definitely help progress the story along because um they really want you to um get to the point where it's like okay follow this and this leads you to where 
you need to be over here, right? So, like, very clear, um, yeah, yeah, gotcha. Okay, we're about to see mixes in a minute. Um, so let's just go ahead and get you. Let me lock in real quick. Um, was it this barrel? Yes. Yep. Look at It's sending out some sort of distress signal and Monty is responding. So we want to calm down. We want to give Mixes a chance to settle down. Um, yeah, I really don't feel any way towards these. I think they're, you know, they exist. These parts are low-key kind of fun. I actually kind of enjoy this part. Um, it is, like, very nerve-wracking when you're in a situation where Mixes is, like, on your behind and you need to get it done. But, you know, I think that's good. I think that really helps build the atmosphere, build that, that, you know, tense, t intensity that they're, they were going for. Um, yeah, honestly, it, it's, it's really good mechanic, I think, now that I'm talking to myself. Like, in terms of horror factor, I think it actually contributes to it, because it makes it so it's like, okay, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. There are some parts where it probably could have been better placed. Like, I think the part with Monty, right? Like, the part where you're jumping, uh, like, tr Monty swimming around. You're trying not to, you know, make him upset and all that. I feel like that part maybe was a little, like, goofy. Because first time playing, it does. It is like, oh my god, oh my god. I have to be in the water to do this. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Right? But then... He doesn't even really exist, because <laughs> he's, like, he's kind of bust, like, bugged out, so he, like, tends to stay on that one, like, that one area. He doesn't even really, like, chase you down there. So, it's not like he's that big of a threat at that point. Um, okay, Monty should come back again. Yep. Alright. Okay, we don't actually want to do that yet, though. We need to find wherever the places that this present was at. Because I kind of forgot. I don't think it's... I know that door exists. I think I need to... Yeah, it's here. So take that off. And then, yeah, there's actually just a present chillin' in here. Okay, so comic page five. This is from the driving ending. Gregory was always so creative. Yes, he was. Yeah, that's from the, the straight-up steal a car and get out ending. And then moving along here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Nightmare plush, got that. Comic page five. Right, got that. Okay, I think, let's see, AR Tragedy Mask. We have that, Cry. Add, now I'm crying. Great. What is that? That's an Audi? I'm good. Okay, so that should be it for chapter one. So, I'm gonna go hit a save point real quick. And, uh... Then we can back out of here and go right into chapter two. <laughs> so let's go... Down here... I 
I just need a save point, please, game. Just give me a save point anywhere, really. I don't... I'm not picky. Not a picky individual here. Just need to see that little... Just need to see that little thing spinning around the bottom of my screen. Right. You're perfectly okay, Monty. Um... One more thing while we're talking about mechanics. Mixes, right? It's like mixes is is a thing. He exists. Um, I think in terms of gameplay, again, I think mixes is great. <laughs> um, like looking, I think while I was playing through it, he was genuine. Oh, beautiful. Save point. Save point. Let's wait for that to go through. Wait for it to go away. And we're out of here. All right, so if we quit to main menu, we should see um, play ruin, profile one, chapter select. Yeah, cool. Um, I think in terms of escalating the horror factor, I think mixes is great. I do. I think that he's honestly a really cool addition. Now, I saw what he was supposed to look like before. They did the whole, um, before they changed it, he was like a skeleton thing. Honestly horrifying. Like, if they kept him like that, honestly, it would have been even scarier than he is now. Um, my question is why'd they have to make the security system so scary looking? <laughs> just, just asking, you know, why'd they have to make it like that? But, um... I personally think Mixes is great. Um, okay, so AR Moon Plush. Do I have the AR Moon Plush? Okay, I have AR Moon Plush. Right, you have to go up in the castle. Go past there, collect the present. Yep. Okay. Next. AR Moon Pinata. I don't think I have the AR Moon Pinata. Now, where can that be found at? Oh, okay. I think it's that present that I keep seeing. I just don't know how to get to it. It's like on that little toy table. Okay. So let's play this as per usual. Um. Where are you? I'm in daycare. Okay, so we talked about Is mechanics. So let's here? talk about the character Get designs. The let's go back to here. that. There's a way down to the catwalks. Should help you get to the raceway. So, the new character designs, like I was saying before, the ruined animatronics and Cassie, right? So, Cassie basically playing as a little girl now instead of a little boy. And honestly, I think they did a great job. I feel like they made Cassie's character even more, like, honestly cooler looking than Gregory's. Moon's about to pop up. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I think they did made Cassie, like, a really cool character. Even just the fact that, like, her nails are painted green. Like, they, they, they put some cool attention to detail into it, and I think it really paid off for them. Um, I think we have to keep playing this as usual here. Oh, hello. No friend! I, I, I am trapped in a gap! Reboot! Reboot! We need to, to be whole! You want me to reboot you? With this? Not! Not! Fight back, son. My son! Turn generators on! Gotcha. Bye bye. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Alright. Literally that right there. I literally just haven't gotten this gift. Why? Why haven't I gotten this? Why did I completely skip that? <laughs> For what purpose? Um, AR Moon Pinata filled with moon drop candies, and this one was filled with sunny drop candies. Very cool. Let's keep going. AR Moon Pinata. Right. AR Sun Plush. 
That's Golden Sun. I need Sun Plush. I do not have this Sun Plush. Okay, where is this at? Oh, it's actually just behind the desk. I guess I haven't been back there, huh? Okay. Yeah, I literally just need to go behind the desk. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Um... How do I even get... How do I get behind the desk to begin with? Is the real question here. Um... Okay, I think I need to, like, play this normally for a minute. So, Moon... Okay. And then Sun... Right. Okay, so... Um... Yeah, great job with Cassie. And, like, you can see her in the cutouts, too. Just how... She looks like a happy kid! <laughs> she looks like a happy kid. Like, same as where Gregory... Like, the little band-aid he has on. Like, just cool attention to detail. And I think they... Knocked Cassie out of the park. I think they did a really good job with her character design. As for the animatronics themselves... Okay... The, the whole ruined vibe we got going on. Um, honestly, let's start with mixes. Like I said, um, not an animatronic security system, but again, if you guys haven't seen his original character design, I suggest you look at it because it was absolutely freaky. But I think what they went with now, like, uh, like they made people, a lot of people think this was glitch trap that was stalking us, right? But just the... I think they still did a really great job. He's very intimidating. He's very, like, lengthy and... Like, he, he looks like he doesn't belong. Okay, that's, like, the whole point is that he's not supposed to look like he should exist. Okay? And he doesn't. He looks like he... Is from, like, a whole nother realm of, of plane of existence. And he's, like, t humongous, towering over you. He's, like teleports forward you don't ever see him move and like as he gets closer his like he like starts looming over you like that's that's a pretty sick stuff man <laughs> that's pretty sick okay so it's actually right here ar sun plush i used to have so much fun in the daycare i bet you did i bet you did have fun in the daycare Let's see. Okay, next is AR Golden Sun. That's what I just looked at. Um, so yeah, they did a good job with mixes too. While we're here, let's talk about the daycare attendant. Um, the Sun Moon mashup into Eclipse is actually the best thing in this game. Um, AR Comedy Mask. I have that. Wait, no, that's AR Sun Mask. Oh no, I don't have the AR Comedy Mask. Where would one find the AR comedy mask? Where in the world is that? What am I looking at here? There's like stars? There's like glitchy stars. Somewhere. Okay. Guess we have to be looking for like some glitchy stars somewhere. I have absolutely no idea where that is. Is that like... Where are these... Where in the world would I even look? Um... Let me, like, circle the, the perimeter here and see if I can find this. Because that's some weird mess right there. No more sun. No light. Keep it moving. Forever night. Yeah, yeah. Forever night. No more light sleep tight don't let the bed bugs bite okay i don't think there's any way to get through here um i, I kind of i have no idea where i should even look um ar comedy mask let me see ar comedy mask uh ar comedy mask and right after the section where you hack Moon... Okay, so, 
I actually do. I was thinking maybe I need to just keep playing the game as normal, and I do, so. Oh, shoot. Okay. My bad. That's blocked off. Uh, get that. Then the sun. Cap. Okay, now we're stuck with the mask on, which is fine. Yeah, b just back to mechanics real quick. The sections where you have the mask on and you're stuck with it are also very scary. Because, like, yeah, like, as I was saying. Um. But, yeah, sun and moon mashed up, okay? So, like, it was all very, like, confirmed. They're the same animatronic, right? They just switch personalities, yada, yada. That was already cool in of itself, okay? But now, they're like, present at the same time. Moon is trying to kill us, but Sun is trying to protect us, and he's fighting back. And they like, really, like, listen to him. Like, he sounds like he's in pain. <laughs> Sun and Moon sound like some Moon at least sounds like he's in pain and Sun sounds desperate to free himself. And they're like and he's like fighting back. Like I can like look at him. Like we got Sun's pants, but we're blending in. We got Moon's hat cuz Moon's like the one taking over right now. He's basically deadlocked. He can't move. He's got like barbed wire or like the the, the what's underneath here, right? He's actually straight up missing a leg. This leg is like broken, or he's missing a foot. Like, my boy. But then we go ahead and we reboot him. And then we get... Happy birthday. Eclipse! One, one, and he's straight up flying. Danger. Mode active. Like, look at that. Like, his yellow eye, his red eye. He's got Moon's hat with the sun beams. See, that's awesome. Like, see, and then he's like, thank. See, like, he sounds grateful to have been freed. He does. He sounds super happy that we just did that for him. And I'm happy I could do it for him. I do. I'm happy. That that part right there makes me happy. To, to have done. Like, you're welcome, man. You are so welcome. Um. So, yeah. Overall, I really like that part. Um. Because he's not even, like, a threat. He's just, like, there. He exists. And he just feels like he, he needs to be freed. He needs to be freed. Um. When you've been flown out of the playpen by Eclipse, head into the gift shop. Okay, wait, so let me go back, actually. Am I going the right way? Yeah, okay. I need to go back. Um. Like, they're both merged into one at that point. And it's like... That's so cool looking. Okay, I know the gift shop is like on the outside here, but where? How do I, how does one get to the gift shop again? Oh wait, here's the gift shop. I can't get in here though. I, that was a lie I just told. I very much can. Okay. Okay, here we go. Glitchy stars. AR comedy mask. Well, there you go. Alright. Let's take a look at it. AR comedy mask. Laugh. Very thrilling detail right there. Okay, so... Am I done in the daycare? Am I done in the daycare? AR Golden Moon. I have that. Um, 
so yeah eclipse like they show moon flying like that was something that made moon really cool in the base game is like he would connect himself to wires and fly around and he would like crawl through the the play equipment and it was super scary here it's just you know he's just chilling there okay we're actually done here so we are done with chapter two here so i'm just gonna like get a save point um now they're just deadlocked he's just pleading for help and then there when he flies you down it doesn't really show him connecting to wires or anything he kind of just does it he kind of just does it he just flies down that's all there is to it Um. Okay, I'm gonna just do this whole node, I think, right? I might as well. Because I don't think I get a save point here until I actually finish this part. I think this is one here. Like this entire freaking, yeah. So let's take it off and let Mixes have a chill session. Um, Endos look the exact same. Nothing different about the Endos. Freddy, we can talk about the base animatronics now. Freddy, right? He's, like, legit, um, like, he's prototype Freddy. He's not actually Freddy, he's a prototype, is what I should be saying here. Prototype Freddy, you know? Pretty sick. Okay, I need to be going down here. I can actually take the mask off, because now I can just look this way. And they'll be... Oh, I see him, too. Look at you. You're a goober. Let's go ahead and do this. See, because now you're... very active. And now if I just run past... Go ahead, do this right now. Quickly connect you guys. I think he exists now, but that's not even an issue. I bet the doors are open now. I bet they are too, Cassie. Save point has been achieved. You love to see it. Alright, so let's wait for that to go away. And we are set. Alright. Um Prototype Freddy, right? We're used to our our happy go lucky superstar freddy but now the prototype i don't know what they were doing with him because geez louise see all collectibles found chapter three yeah my poor boy freddy head gone his stomach is just a monster he had the present you know he's got that going for him i guess but for the rest of it <laughs> it was like, well, dang. <laughs> um, <coughs> so let's see what I need here. Okay, Sun Pinata. I think I have that. I do have that. So we have the Sun Pinata. Again, I think I've made it very clear that this is my least favorite of the chapters. AR Glam Chica Plush. I think I have that. I do. Comic Page 2. I think I got that yesterday. Off camera. I did. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. AR Foxy Plush. Golden Foxy. 
Okay, I don't have this AR Foxy plush. Where in the world? Where is this guy at? Okay, I need to go back to the website now, because... What am I looking at here? Scroll back up. AR... Foxy. AR Foxy. AR Foxy plush. Um, that's Glam Chica. Maintenance room? After you leave the gator gondola. Okay, so I basically have to play through this entire thing to get to this plushie. This creaky. I really hope it's ah! Cassie is a... The kids at FNAF are just different breeds. Alright, uh, so while we're riding down the gator gondola, we can we can talk here. So yeah, Prototype Freddy, while he's chasing you, you have you get a chance to get a good look at him. I think they did a great job of, like, how would he look if he was scary. You can actually get jump scared by Freddy in the main game if you're in him while he runs out of battery. But, you know, it's scary. Not nearly as scary as prototype freddy really sick um and like the fact that since he's not like i think the because i was like just looking at things about like why he's not in the database like when you put on the ar mask he's not there like he can't find you i think it has something to do with like him not being in the database or something like that like he since he's just a prototype he's not registered in the system yet so Again, that's sick. Um, Chica. Chica's just broken Chica, but even more so, and she's got cheese everywhere. Adds up. Fits with her character pretty well. <laughs> cheese. She's eating. She literally eats while you're, like, trying to avoid her. She's literally eating. Like, can't get much more Chica than that <laughs> right there. That is, like, prime Chica activity right there. Um, so, yeah, what are you gonna do? <laughs> that, that's Chica to a T. Um, yeah, hop off. Upsy daisy. Alright. Um, Monty? If I had to guess, or if I had to say, I'd say Monty. Cassie? Is probably. I made it to catwalks. You said I could get to the raceway from here. Hold on. The schematics say there's a way to redirect the gondolas to the maintenance room. Deactivate the security node. Then use the track control. Gregory, you there? Of course not. Of course. So, security node and tracking controller. Whatever that is. The floor is all slippery. I say Monty's probably the scariest for me. Just to be so completely honest, I think Monty's the scariest for me. Because he's like so absolutely out of his mind in Ruin. <coughs> he's like genuinely like an alligator. Like what I picture a rabid gator would be like, that's Monty. Like he's insane in, in Ruin. He like... You basically get an idea of how crazy he is in that first sequence. Because he's literally, like, running around like an absolute madman. Like, just causing mayhem and, and disaster absolutely everywhere. Like, that is, that's, that's Monty Gator. That is exactly how he is. Like, in, in the base game, before you, like, actually break him and he's just like walking around right he's fast but once he's on like two legs right because he's basically how he is when you like drop the bucket on him and he's like bugging out after that he's basically like that but worse because like once you um like in here in ruin he's like a hot mess like he is not okay in any capacity. 
Um, okay. I don't think I need to be over here. So let me kind of work my way back. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So let's go back this way. Upsy daisy. Let's go over here now. Okay, um... Okay, yeah, that's not doable. There's definitely some more things I gotta drop down. I know that. Uh, let's go over here. You would think after me playing this so much, I would, like, have a, like, definitive route that I take. But... Every time I play through this, it's basically as if I have never touched this in my life. Because that, that's just why I don't like this part. Because it's always super confusing for me. Um, so, like, now I go over here. But, like, not really, actually. Now I just go back down here. Like, where am I going right now? I don't know. Let's go back over here. Um, yeah, so, like, Monty's basically how he is after you drop the bucket on him. Except now he's... Oh God, I'd say more messed up. <laughs> he's, like, been, like, there's not a single thing of plating on him now. It's all just, uh... It's all just endo. Endo underneath. And his mohawk. He keeps the mohawk. No matter what happens to Monty... The mohawk stays in place. He never loses the mohawk, which I think is hilarious. Okay, maybe I just cross back over here. Um, yeah, his mohawk, that red mohawk, basically his signature at this point. Really can't have Monty without the mohawk. Um... Why do I not know anything right now? I don't know where I'm going, what to do, why why to do it. Oh, okay, wait. There's, okay, I need to be there. Right. Right. That makes sense. So I need you. Get up here. Okay. Um. I for I lost my train of thought because this I I really do not like this place. Um. Yeah. Monty and his mohawk. Gotta have it. Gotta love it. Um. But he's just like actually super. As I was saying, super sporadic. Um. You don't really know what he's going to do. He's kind of just a hot mess. Whoa. Okay, my bad. Jeez. It's sending out some sort of distress signal and Monty is responding. Yeah, it is not that deep, man. It is not. It is never that deep. Like holy. Okay, I need to get rid of you. Bingo. Right. Cool, cool, cool. What are you doing there? You good? You're fine. That's where I just came out of the portal, so... Okay. Yeah, now I need to do this one here. I'm always either really good at this one or horrible. Okay. That was honestly pretty solid. The security system won't let you leave unless you deactivate the child notes first. I think I know that, Gregory, but thank you. Thank you for your input, man. 
Alright, let's go across here. I guess the last one to talk about... Well, I guess not actually the last one, because there's also the entity and all that stuff. Um, but Roxy... Roxy just can't catch a break. Um, we already took her eyes, and now it, it just gets progressively worse. Um, now she just doesn't have a face anymore. We just took her face privileges entirely. She has zero face. Um, you know, sorry. <laughs> and in this game, she's actually, like, kind of a good guy, too. So it, it is, like, like, spy bad. But, you know, it's also, like, I, in the base game, I hate Roxy. Because she, like, lunges at you, and that mess is not fun at all. But here, you know, it, it definitely adds to it just the fact that no face whatsoever. It's insanity. She <laughs> like she what, looks what absolutely insane. I took care of it. Boom. So yeah, we shouldn't see mixes for a while now. Uh huh. Back across. Alright. So now. We're going. Okay, see, now I never understand how to get back. Always forget. Let's go this way. I think this way is right. To some extent. Mm hmm. Okay, yeah, stairs. Stairs going up. That's right. Um, so yeah, Roxy, no major changes uh, except for her just being even more broken down than, than usual. <laughs> she just, like I said, she can really can't catch a break. Um... That's really all there is to her. I think I need to use this portal over here. So let's go use it. Go through here. Well, what are you waiting for? Trying to figure out how to get back to your place, Gregory. If you want to wait a minute, Gregory. Um, yeah, Roxy, Roxy's Roxy, but even more eyeless than usual. Okay, I think I'm back. I think I'm on the right track now. Oopsie-daisy. Yep, this is right. All right. Go over here. Oh, my bad. Excuse me there. Let's go ahead and use this. Um, uh, no. Pretty sure it was good for me to just... Honestly, I don't remember if I was able to just connect him like that. I think I can. Yeah. Then I just... Where are you going there? And I just bring it around like that. And that opens up. And now, I'm able to keep it going. So I want to just book it straight across here. Um, and then as for like the entity, the the mimic, whatever you want to call it, I guess there's technically two versions to talk about. There's like you know normal version, like for elevator ending entity, big endoskeleton. I guess he's just a giant guy. He's huge, just a giant endoskeleton. Very cool. Not too much happening with him. He's just a giant endoskeleton. Really all there is to say about it. Um, there's really not much to it other than he is a giant endoskeleton. <laughs> um, very creepy when he's chasing you. It's like, really does feel like there's like a, a, a force of nature behind you um but the mascot you're getting closer how do you know 
How are you doing any of this? I'll explain it all when you get here. If that thing is here again, I gotta hide. Mm. Save me, Cassie, please. Man, Gregory really sounds desperate. Mimic did a good job. Um. Okay, so it says it should be right here, actually. That was a lie I just told. Then where is it? Where should it be, then? Should it be here? There's something back here? There is something back here. Look at that. AR Foxy plush. Ooh, AR collectibles. That log ride was so much fun. Oh. I never got to see a log ride. That's all I'm gonna say. In the base game, we never got to do the log ride. Okay, so AR Foxy plush. Right, right, right. Okay, chapter four. Cool. So let's let's get a save point going here. Um, that should be our save point right there. I feel like that right there is is good, right? Pretty sure that's a save point. I'm like not. That's what it looks like in the base game, but like now it's got like this whole purple icon thing. So I'm not sure if that's just the game loading, like to catch up, or if that's a save point. I don't know. Because I don't want to leave and then it didn't save and I have to come back and... You know what? We're just gonna... We're just gonna see and cross our fingers and hope that we don't have to... Let's just hope that we... Oh my god, it didn't save. It didn't save. It didn't save it. Oh no, it didn't save it. Okay, if I were you guys, I'd just skip ahead to chapter four. Because I'm about to speedrun this to another level. Dude, I didn't know, I wasn't sure if that counted as a save point or not. Oh my lord. Okay, I'm not even going to talk that much. Just fall. Fall, fall, fall. Really hope it's fall! Yep, yep, yep. Oh, now I have to do this again. Oh. Why? I thought that that's what the saves look like in the base game. So I thought that was the save right there. Oh, I hate this level so much. This part is so not fun in any way, shape, or form. In any way, shape, or form. This part is so bad. So bad. This part's cool. This is the only good part. The rest of it is just horrible. Worst part ever. I, I like the. I would rather do the music men because at least then I have like some chance to evade them and, and just get around it, kind of do it how I want to. Here it's just wow, very cool. Like, holy man. Give me a break. <sighs> Can this thing crash? Please. Can we please crash? And have to jump off. Come on. Dude, I cannot believe that mess didn't save. The only chapter I get to skip is nine. There's no more track. I gotta get off of it. It's not stopping. All right, world record speed run right now. World record. Cassie, where are you? Gregory, I made it to catwalks. You said I could get to the raceway from here. Hold on. Gregory, you there? The floor is all slippery. Not. So, 
security node, and tracking controller. Whatever that is. Freaking wrong way again. Monty doesn't even, like, show up in this level, so... Ugh! I'm gonna puke! How did I get over here? Shoot, dude. It's sending out some sort of distress signal, and Monty is responding. He gives me saves for doing literally everything, but when I freaking try to do that... There it is.
Okay. Yeah, if you're watching me do this right now again, you're a real one. If you didn't skip. You are a real fan. Should I do like those other YouTubers do? Like, say a code word, and if you comment that code word, like, I know you're a real one, because you're watching this part. If you comment the word... Lightning. In the comments, I'll know you're a real one for watching this basically no commentary playthrough of me doing this. I will greatly appreciate you as a human being. <sighs> so I probably have to go and get the thing again, too. That's not that big of a deal. I'm kind of getting the hang of this part, though, which is good. I'm practicing. For what? No idea. Because I, I don't... Not probably not gonna revisit this again after this, but you know, I'm practicing. On we go. Alright. You did great. You're getting closer. How do you know? How are you doing any of this? I'll explain it all when you get here. That thing is here again. I gotta hide. Save me, Cassie, please. Okay, so this is probably around the point where Okay, yeah, see this thing? That's tricky. You're not tricking me, Helpy. Whatever I said about Helpy being useful, I would like to revoke that statement. Helpy is a trickster. Okay, so this is probably where a lot of you guys came back. Hello. Welcome. Um, if you see people spamming words in the comments, don't concern yourself with that. Um, I'm like almost positive that I just need to get a save point and like be done with my... be done here. Because AR Foxy Plush, blah. Yeah, and then Chapter 4, so... We really just need a save point game. Please. Please just let me save. Would really appreciate it, actually. Whoa. Alright. Okay. So now... Go up the ladder. Upsie daisy. Run across here. Do this can do it. Um, what was I talking about before I whiffed like that? I don't even remember. Um, I think I was talking about the entities, right? The, the mimics and all that. Um, yeah, so the mascot one is by far scarier than the base one. Um, still have no idea what the significance of that thing is why it exists, what its purpose is, what what it what it does, nothing. Like why why? Why a mascot? Like what school does it belong to? Or like what what? What? Like a lion. It's like a lion. Like is it a mascot for the restaurant? But like that doesn't make sense either because it's all about Freddy Fazbear. There's no Freddy Fazbear lion and Freddy Fazbear, so what are we doing here? I had to... I don't... Oh. I don't know. Chica? What's poppin', Chica? You just mind your own business, yeah? Um... So yeah, Mascot's pretty cool. Um, not pretty cool. Very cool. Mascot is awesome. The mascot is honestly really awesome. This should be it. Please say I'm done. Please say that's it. Please let me... Okay, I'm going to quit again, and if I have to replay this... Again, you're not going to be seeing this video.
Okay, hi guys. I think you guys may be able to see this video. Cool. All right, let's go back in. Yay. Okay, AR Glam Bonnie plush. I think I got that. Almost positive I have this Glam Bonnie plush. But let me check. Let, let's take a look, see. Okay. AR Glam Bonnie. Do have it. Next. Comic page seven. I got one, two, five, and eight. So where's seven? Oh, whoa. Where is that? Okay. I think I may know where that is, actually. So let's go do that. Hey, down there. He's back. I got kicked out of the Vanny network. You said you got rid of that rabbit thing. What happened? Mm-hmm. All right, I should be good. Maybe, maybe not. Got it. Okay. All right, Cupcake's probably gonna swat us off right now. <laughs> that right there is super cool. What else, what else is there to talk about? Um, I guess the plot, right? So it's like basically, Cassie gets called for like, Cassie basically gets a message from air quotes Gregory, right? And since they're seemingly best friends. <gasps> yep, yep, get that cupcake. I know you can't miss that for the world. Since they're seemingly best friends, we want to go lead her there. Gregory, are you there? Um, she decides to take this horrifying experience and... Whoa. Move it. Ah! Yeah, go away, please. Appreciate you. Okay. I need to go somewhere. Where? I'm not Finally. sure, but somewhere. Bet I can use the mask again. I need to find like a staticky TV screen. There should be like a staticky TV screen somewhere. Unless, did I accidentally pass it up? I may have accidentally passed it up. Let me look. Comic page 7. There's a chance I have to restart this one, and I've accidentally passed it up. We'll see. Is this all? This is AR collectibles. No, I need real. Why couldn't they have just put them in the same thing? I need FNAF Ruin collectibles. Real collectibles, please. Comic page 7. Okay. 
Okay, yep. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. It happens right after the cupcake pushes you off. It happens right after cupcake pushes you. And I did not realize that. So, let's try that one more time. Um, so Cassie, right? Um, and begs the question, did Gregory show up to her birthday party? Because Roxy, like, was saying, like, maybe your friends will come next time. Was Gregory there? Hmm? Did Gregory come to the birthday party? That's my question. That's what I want to know. Ow, ow, ow. I got kicked out of the Vanny network. You said you got rid of that rabbit thing. What happened? And I won't be good. I am. Um, okay, so it happens right here. Hello. Bye bye. Okay, so now I'm supposed to turn around. Oh, yep, there it is. Comic page seven. Okay, this is from the ending where you take her ability and send all the bots to kill her. Gregory should be an artist when he grows up. <laughs> Honestly, yes, he should. These are fire images. Look how fire these are. Look at that. That is some clean art. <laughs> he looks like a gremlin, though. Um... What was I doing? Video. Video. Comic page 7. AR Chica Lunchbox. Got that. Next. AR Golden Freddy. Got that. Next. Okay, so that's actually literally the only thing I needed in this chapter. So once we get a save point, we can move on. As in, right now. Thank goodness, because this chapter is actually really long. Because you have to do the whole, like... Yeah, this chapter is really long. You have to do the whole, like, server room thing, too, and... Nah, -uh. I'm good. Play Ruin, Profile 1, Chapter Select. Huh? Huh? I did it! Did I not do it? Did I not just... Oh my god. These. This is going to be the death of me. This is genuinely going to be the, the death of me. I'm going to die doing this. Okay, let me check one more time. AR Foxy. Oh, wait, what? AR Foxy plush? We are so past that. Chapter 4, right. AR Glam Bonnie. Inventory. AR. AR Glam Bonnie. Moving on. Okay, comic page seven. That's the one I was missing. I needed comic page seven. Ow, ow, ow! I got kicked out of the Vanny network. You said you got rid of that rabbit thing. What so I happened? did comic page seven. I got a save point. And for some reason, it didn't let me stay with comic page seven. Saying I'm missing something. What am I missing, game? 
Please tell me what I'm missing, game. Please. I very much want to know what it is that I'm missing, because I seem to not know. Third time seeing this cupcake hit us off. Okay, anyway, so Cassie comes here. Um. Okay, okay. What is that then? What is it? What are you? What are you on about? Okay, inventory. Real collectibles. I have it, okay? I have comic page seven. Right? Right? I have comic page seven. Okay. AR Chica lunchbox. I have that. I got the Chica lunchbox. I do. It's right there in my inventory. You can you can check it. It's there. AR Golden Freddy. Look at him. I have him too. Mm-hmm. Okay. So it seems like the only ones you can get are AR Golden Freddy, AR Chica Lunchbox, Comic Page 7. So now I'm going to check this, this website again. Okay, so there's only one comic page in Chica's Bakery, right? And then if I go back to the AR Collectibles website, because for some reason they're separate for literally no reason. If I go back to AR Collectibles, there's AR Chica's Lunchbox. Wait, AR Foxy Mask. Okay, now that's actually different, but I didn't see that the first time. AR, because I, I don't have AR Foxy Mask now. I have AR Foxy. No mask, though. So let's get that. Found in the bathroom connected to Chica's bakery kitchen when you enter through the tunnel in the cupcake using the security mask. Head through the door to your right. Okay. So there you go. See, so I was missing something. And this website I was... Or this video I was watching was wrong. Incorrect. So maybe I should just start using this website. I'm not sure. Wait for her to, you know, do her little shindig. Alright. <laughs> yeah, get your, get your, yep. We, we know you're hungry, Chica. We do, in fact, know you are hungry. Go back to the acid. Are you there? Too many escape presses. All right. Hey, Chica. Go through here. Get grabbed. Bye bye. All right. So yeah, earthquake happens. Totals this place. Finally. Bet I can use the mask again. But all the animatronics in it are still very much active. Trying their best to... Honestly, they are on, like, their last legs. <laughs> trying their best to survive. Okay, so... See? There you go. I did not have this. Now I do. My day has been made better. Okay? Inventory. AR... AR Foxy Mask. Okay, is that it? Was that the last thing I needed from this chapter, please? Um. Uh, AR Foxy Mask. AR Golden Freddy Chica's Bakery Virtual Server Room. Okay, now theoretically speaking, that should be it. This should be it. So I'm going to go ahead and play. Where is the... Where's the thing I need to get in here? 
Just a trash can. Does this give me a save? I don't know. No, it doesn't. Okay, that's fine. Okay, right, there's things in the actual bakery I need to go do. So let's go. Do them. Okay, I know one is a lollipop. One is something else that I don't remember, but it's not a lollipop. Okay, so lollipop. Right. Then the last thing I needed to get was something, but I honestly don't remember. So I need to look through my mask and see. Oh, it's trash can. Cool. Give it to me. All right. Now, go back around through this cracked out looking cupcake, take off the mask, go over here, put it on, go here, do this puzzle, go do 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 Mask off. Alright. Now I should be done. Because after this is like the server room stuff. So. Okay. Quit. Quit. We should be good now. Ruin, profile, chapter select. Four is done. That's what we like to see. Okay. That is what we like to see. All right. Chapter five, AR Glam Roxy. Well, let's go into chapter five. <sighs> We're making our way through here. Slowly but surely, we are making our way through here. We will get this done. Okay. Um, so, what are we looking at here? AR Glam Roxy. Got that. Let me go. I need to, like, swap between websites here. AR Glam Roxy checks out. So, if this, this video should have AR Glam Roxy. Wait, what? AR Glam Roxy Plush. AR Glam Roxy. Why does it have AR Glam Roxy Plush twice? AR Glam Roxy Plush. Okay, I think that's just an accident. I don't think it's supposed to have that twice. Um, AR Glam Roxy Plush. And Golden Plush Baby. I have that too. Let me see where he goes. Air Glam Roxy Plush. Very obvious where that is. And then... Comic page 4. Okay, I'm seeing it. I'm seeing it. Okay, so... That's just... Okay, so instead of going to the mirror, I go to there. Now let me go to the other website. Clarify. So real collectibles. Let's make sure that's the only thing that should be in here. Glamrock Salon comic page 4. Okay. So let's go through here. <laughs> Not trying hard enough. Look at Roxy. Poor Roxy. 
Who's there? Hmm. You can't hide from me. You can't hide from me. Gregory. No! Gregory with the clutch, though. Gregory, run! Roxy's after you! Gregory, are you there? Cassie, I'm okay. I mm -hmm. found a spot to hide. Turn off the nodes mm -hmm. in the salon to follow Roxy. Hurry! She's close! Mm -hmm. I bet she is close. Gregory! Forgot about gotta that. Gotta get in there. Okay, speed running. Speed run time. Speed run time. This part is also a little confusing to me, even though I've played it like twice already. But that's okay. I'll figure it out. So I know this is one here. We want to get that. Mask is gonna stay glued onto our again. base now. That's okay. We just run through here. Hit the inhibitor. Take mask off. Keeping things going here. We want to run back down here. And there's a present here. Collect. Comic page four. All right. Gregory must have seen this mask before. He sure has. He sure, in fact, has seen this mask before. So one, two, four, five, seven, eight. One, two. So we're missing three and six. So we're only missing two comic pages now. So that's not horrible. So that comic page. So I think that was the only thing I was missing from here. And then, yeah, then it goes to AR Golden Plush Baby. Which was up where I thought there would be a gift, because there was one. Because I'm just like that. AR Golden Plush Baby. Add. <laughs> that is so funny. Yep, that's it. That's all I'm missing from here. Okay, I literally could have been done with this the first playthrough if I wasn't blind, but we're okay. So, wait. It's hitting me with a save already. Hold on. <laughs> Hold your horses. Maybe we could just get in here. Hey, I'm dipping. Hold on. Hold on. We should be good. I know I should be more careful than to just prematurely leave like this, but... <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. Chapter 6. Let's get it going. AR Moon Mask. I know I have this already. I know I already have the AR Moon Mask. I am absolutely, positively sure that I have the AR Moon Mask. I know it. I know it, I know it, I know it. Get me in here. Inventory, AR, Moon Mask. Yes. Now, let's... We have to keep looking at our websites here. Okay, so... We should be approaching comic page 3 here. So, we sh yeah, we should see comic page 3 here in a minute. Let's go to AR Collectibles. Okay, but they also had comic page 3 there twice, so I don't know what it's on. Um... AR Moon Mask. Two AR Moon Masks for some reason. AR Plush Baby. Just normal Plush Baby. I have that. Then it goes to Bonnie Bowl, which is chapter 7. So we should only be missing this comic page, it would seem. So, right. You go in, get your Moon Mask, man. You got that. AR Moon Mask, right? Okay, comic page three is what I need. It's in this back corner in the middle of nowhere. Gotcha. Gregory? Gregory! I made it to the raceway. Are you okay? Yeah, he's fine. Hmm. Don't don't worry about him. I might be able to get a signal if I head deeper into the raceway. 
Another hilarious statement. Fall. So funny. Do you need assistance? Do you need assistance? Do you need Do you assistance? Need assistance? Okay, I should be back here. Be quiet. Wait. Wait. Unless I'm royal tri royally tripping right now. Because I go... Should be back. No, I'm royally, I'm royally tripping right now. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold your horses now. Okay, wait. That might be... I think I need to get to the part where the go-kart almost hits us. Maybe? I feel like that's where that is. I think? Let's use this. We just need to do one at a time. I know better than to try to do them both like that. Close. All right, Roxy, it's up to you now. Which Where's way are we going? You going that way? Sounds good to me. Just make sure you stay going that way if you that's your plan. All right, so let's get you. <laughs> Cool. I'm so, <laughs> I'm so scared and alone. Beautifully done. Okay. So it's actually right here. Yup. Comic page three. So what is this from? Real collectibles. So we have one, two, three, four, five. So now we're just missing six. Okay. How long was Gregory working on these? I don't know, but they're really good. Okay, so this is like when he is about to burn down the place. Gregory? You can't hide forever. I'm gonna go she until I get yet. one more. I safe. better find him first. Let me settle down for a minute. <laughs> Let's calm down. You can't hide forever. Because the only thing the mask does for Roxy is make us see what she used to look like. Hope that was it. That was it. All right. So we should be good now. Let's wait for this to go. And bada bing, bada boom. Let's get out of here. All right. <sighs> okay. Ruin, profile one, chapter select. Six done, seven. So let's go to, let's see what chapter seven has. Thank goodness I did tr like at least attempt to look thoroughly through <laughs> this place because it saves me a lot of time. Not having to go and go and get every single one. Like I actually did make an attempt to get them already. 
chapter 7. Oh, there's actually a fast token you can get. Interesting. So, chapter 7 is bowling, right? Yeah, so chapter 7 is bowling. So it says AR Bonnie Mask, AR Golden Foxy, AR Golden Bonnie. Um. Okay. Chapter 8 was like the brief Phaser Blast part. Um, and then. Okay. AR. Bonnie Mask. Golden Foxy. Golden Bonnie. AR. Okay. Golden Foxy. Golden Bonnie. Bonnie Mask. And then for real collectibles, it's one of the fast tokens. So there's a single fast token in Bonnie Bull here. So let's go ahead and do it. Okay, and this is where comic page one was, but I did that. So let me see. Okay, so fast token. I don't think I got that fast token either, which is kind of surprising because this president is like pretty obviously right here. So clearly I was not thoroughly examining this room. Okay, Faz token claimed. An out old and outdated, a collector's item. Okay, what's next? Let's get to our inventory here. AR Bonnie mask. Got that. Right, so you go in that door there. And there's the gift right there. Mm-hmm. Comic page one. I have that. This was... I think the first comic page I got, too. Okay. Golden Foxy. I have that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Golden Bonnie. That's what I need. I need Golden Bonnie. I do not have that. So, Golden Bonnie should be further back. Somewhere over there. Golden Foxy, right? So, Golden Bonnie... Okay, I see where that is. So, that's pretty deep here, so... We have to just go ahead and play here. So let's just run through... I don't think you act up or anything. Mask. Mask. We can kind of just speed run through here. Keep it going. Okay, okay. Up these stairs. I might be able to even just book it straight to the place I need to go. Alright. Now we're back here. Cool. So I'm just gonna go. This here is my second least favorite one. I hate these music men and everything that they stand for. So yeah, I'm basically, I'm pretty sure that the way that music man down there works is essentially what you do 
is see these guys, you take them over here, and you do it a few times, because sometimes you get a couple scragglers that don't feel like cooperating with the rest. What are those things? They look like the DJ. Put on the mask. Then you take this one, okay? So once you deactivate that bad boy, you're gonna wanna go over here. They are gonna be deactivated, but not only will they be deactivated, that one down the hall should also be deactivated. So this is what I have heard. I have heard that now this guy will not act up. And from the looks of it, that was correct. So now there should be a gift here. Don't know how in the world I missed that. AR Golden Bonnie. Cool. A prototype? Maybe. Maybe. All right, AR Golden Bonnie. Very nice. AR Helpy plush, no way. I don't think I have an AR Helpy plush. Uh-uh. Oh, there's a present back there? There's a present in the freaking Easter egg room, guys. I had no idea. I was looking for him. I guess I, I should have put on my mask. Oh, I wonder what he looks like with the... Okay. I should already have everything in place to just do it. I think. If I, if I am correct. I should be able to just open this thing up again. Because I already got all the others, so... I don't see why I wouldn't be able to just pop this thing open and get things over with here. Just deactivate you. Yeah, sweet. Alright, that's cool that this is just available to us now. So yeah, there's actually a present here. AR Helpy Plush. Would you look at that? Hi, Bonnie. Good to see you again. Helpy, where is he? So cute. While we're here, what do you look like? Nothing. Nope, you're the you're the same. You are in fact the same. All right. Well, poor you. Uh. Okay. I think that was it. I think pretty sure that was the last thing I needed. Cause yeah, then it goes into chapter eight. So before I get a save point and call it a day. Let me inventory AR collectibles. Um, what was I doing? Okay, real collectibles, fast token. Um, comic page one, and that should be it for that. And then for AR collectibles, I'm just missing. What am I missing in AR collectibles? I need AR. Okay, the website reloaded. Love that. Okay. Okay, we're, we're past that. AR Golden Foxy. And then AR Golden Bonnie. And then the, these next ones are in Fazer Blast. So I think I'm good now. I think I'm set, so I think the best way to get a save point actually is to go and open that one room and then just literally go in there and get that out the way. Like that's straight up just the easiest way to get a save point because as soon as you walk into this room you get a save point anyways so like this right here is the most simple simple and effective so take this one all the way down because it ends up working out like that then we want to take this one about there take that one take this one beautiful save point all right game knowledge is coming in clutch right now so i'm gonna wait for this to go Pretty sure all the collectibles from this location have been gotten. 
So let's go ahead and quit. Play Ruin. Profile 1, Chapter Select. Chapter 7 done, so now we only have one more chapter. Chapter 8, and funny enough, Chapter 8 is my least played chapter. All these other ones, 1 through 7, I've played 3 times now. It's same thing with Chapter 9, actually, I've played 3 times. I've only played Chapter 8 once. <laughs> I've only had to play Chapter 8 once, so... Honestly, don't even remember that much from it. I know Fazer Blast is there, and of course I know Freddy is there. And I think that's all it had. Um, I think I mentioned this before, but I really like that this DLC has you exploring places that you didn't really need to prior. I think that's a really, really cool just mechanic that it has set up. Okay, Chapter 8. So, AR Glam Freddy. AR. I do not have AR Glam Freddy. Interesting. Maybe because it's in like the dark ether. What in the world am I looking at here? Did the quality of the video drop again? No, okay. Okay. We can get that. So let's go. I don't remember if a music man follows you here. I don't think it does, but I'm gonna be careful anyways. Cause you can never be too safe. I think we're okay. Okay, I see the ending, I can book it. Ugh, I bet those security nodes are all the way down there. Okay. Yup, bad bear, fair bear, whatever, faz bear, bad bear. All that good stuff. Okay. Right, this area. Drop down here. Okay. Now it seems like there's a present back here. Yup. AR Glam Freddy. What we got? Superstar. See, that's the Freddy I know. That right there. That is the Freddy I know. So now we have all four main animatronic AR plushes. Plus the two that aren't in this game, plus Sun and Moon, plus Baby, for whatever reason. Okay. So we have AR Glam Freddy. Next. AR Foxy Lunchbox. I have that. That has been acquired. Next. Comic page six. Okay. Actually, the last thing I need. Right? Yep. Comic page six. Okay. So, in order to get this, we have to go through the whole chase sequence and all that good stuff. So, let's get this on the move. Oh, yeah, this is the one where you have to go quick because the freaking bot is, like, just looking at, or, like, you can't take off the mask. Um. I hear bro. Oh, here we go. I was literally over here. Okay, run back. This part was nerve-wracking. Oh my! Jesus, he's right behind me. Calm. Sim simmer, bro. Simmer, simmer, simmer. Simmer. Simmer down. Oh, gosh. Dude, what in the world was this? Frick, dude. Um...
Yep, I bet it has. Alright. We're chilling. We're okay. We are. A. Okay. Alright. So, wait, let me, let me see where the present was before I... That was the lunchbox, which I got. So you put on your mask. Then you just run through that door. Gotcha. Alright. Freddy! Freddy! Freddy? Are you okay? He's functional. Yeah, I think he's functional. <laughs> For better or worse, he is functional. Got like the craziest lead on him right now. He's never catching me. Yup. Now I have to just book it to this. Mask on. Bye bye. Run through here. Then take off the mask. Collect that. Comic page six. Freddy is Gregory's favorite. <laughs> Crying tears of joy. So I think we have all of the comic pages now. So it goes comic page one. These look like Gregory's drew them. So him running around the corner. Comic page two, it's one of Gregory's comics, so this is like from the bad ending. Comic page three, how long was Gregory working on these? Comic page four, Gregory must have seen this mask before, so these are both from the VIP ending. Comic page five, Gregory was always so creative. The uh, loading dock ending. Comic page six, Freddy is Gregory's favorite. This is just them being happy together, living a life of luxury. Comic page 7, Gregory should be an artist when he grows up. This is from the Destroy Vanny. I think this was the P Princess Quest ending. And then finally, comic page 8, what is that supposed to be? Our boy Bernie, our boy uh, Blobby. So, that's pretty darn cool. And now let me see, because I think that may even be the last gift that I needed. Because I did all the ones in chapter 9. So let's see. Let's go to inventory. Faz token. Okay, no. There's actually another Faz token around here. What am I looking at? Okay, this is when we go to the other website. Because I don't know what I'm looking at here in this video. Real collectibles. Faz token. Faz token one. Faz token two. See, he's saying the sinkhole, but that's not, that's clearly not true. That's clearly not true, though. Okay, so the website doesn't have this one, but the video does. So, we will, oh, love you. love DJ Music Man with a passion. Not DJ Music We do love DJ Music Man. Where, how has he been? That's actually a good question for this game. Where is DJ Music Man in Ruin, huh? We want him. Yeah, you can turn right back around. Okay, looks like it's around here somewhere. Oh. Well, would you look at that. Do I need to run all the way around here? Is that what you want from me? It is. Fast token. Okay. Right. Should be the same. Yeah, they are. Okay. Is that the last thing I needed? Was that it? I sure hope so. AR Freddy lunchbox. 
Let's look at all. Yeah, we got a lot here. AR Freddy lunchbox. I have that. What's next? Okay, see, then it goes to chapter 9. So I might be done. Let's scroll back up on the website. Fast token. Okay, yeah, it's just talking about sinkhole, sinkhole, sinkhole. But I have all those already, thank goodness. And then... Ruin real collectibles. Let's see. Comic page three. Sinkhole, 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 sinkhole. Might be done. So, I think now I just need to get another save point in. Call it there. Any any wind ups? No. Okay, that's bait right there. If you see that, that does not mean leave. That right there means the game is trying to catch up to you. You want to be seeing the little purple Freddy doing its rounds. That's what you want to see. That's how you know you can leave. As in right now. So theoretically speaking, once this goes away, if I quit to remain menu, go to ruin, go to profile, go to chapter select, we're done. That is it. That is all. Finn. 100 percented The Ruin DLC. There you have it. Um, so yeah, that was a pretty long video. <laughs> I had to basically replay the whole game except for the last chapter. Getting all those presents in places I didn't even know, didn't even think to look the first time. So, um, and then I had to replay... Oh, the freaking gator gondola and all the cow walks and stuff. Hate that. But, um, yeah, so there you go. Um, 100%ed the Security Breach DLC. All in all, have to give this game a 9 out of 10. Um, might be because I just am fresh off of it. Um, but actually, I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10. I think that the both the Music Man part and the cow walks part deduct a full point in of themselves um <laughs> but for the most part this game was really good this was like basically what i was kind of missing from the base game more of a creepy atmosphere getting to explore other places besides them just being there for for more gifts um so really great that uh this was made um and, yeah, the plot, I, I don't think I even finished talking about the plot because I started getting locked in. Plot was really cool. I've had some people tell me, like, you know, they wish that it didn't do the whole someone's pretending to be Gregory luring you down. I think it was cool. Um, there's also, like, a lot of stuff. It's like, okay, that's cool. Why is it here? Right? Like, Candy Cadet. Like, okay? Cool, but why? Um, same thing with, like, Prototype Freddy. Same thing with, like, um, the Scooper. It's like, cool, why is it here? And to all the people that say that, I say, just go with it. Um, <laughs> they could put, they could put, I don't even know, um, they could put Phone Guy in this game, and I would appreciate it. They could... I don't care what they put in this game. I don't care if it makes sense. It, it's cool. <laughs> They're Easter eggs. It's, Candy Cadet tells you a story. That's some good stuff right there. So, yeah. Overall, I had a really, really fun time playing through this DLC. Um, Like I said, 
I don't know if any more content is coming to this game or if they're done with it once and for all. I don't know what the plan is uh, with the future of Security Breach. But if this is where they decide to end it, then, you know, there you have it. I had a overall 9 out of 10 experience. This game gave me a lot of really good memories. Um... A lot of content, <laughs> a lot of time spent in this game. Um, just overall, really great, ex really great time. So, with that, I believe that I have fully, completely, absolutely, 100%ed Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach. And uh, I guess I can play other games on the channel now. <laughs> so if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure you hit the subscribe button. It helps me out a lot. Also, make sure you hit the like button so I see you guys are liking the content that I'm putting out. Um, guess it's time to go back to Danganronpa, I guess. Right? That's, man, that's like almost a blast from the past, isn't it? You guys probably forgot I was even playing Danganronpa 3 on the channel, didn't you? Well, I, I am. So, you know, I guess we, I guess we go back to that. And, um, yeah, so if you guys are excited for that, make sure you hit the bell so you can notify for that. And other than that, have a nice day and stay awesome. Freddy, Freddy, you are my buddy, but then you got all gnarly. Freddy, Freddy, I'm gonna miss this game. I really am. I really, I hope they do more with this. I know that they're having, like, Help Wanted 2 and all that good stuff coming out. But, you know, I hope they revisit this at some point. Because this game, this game is, like, half my channel at this point. So, you will be missed, Security Breach. You will be missed.